Are you familiar with the mighty god of fire in Hindu mythology? Venerated as a primordial deity, Agni is more than just the burning flame god. He is a messenger between humans and the gods, a guardian of cosmic order and a symbol of purification and transformation. His figure is revered as much as feared, reflecting his destructive but also restorative nature. Agni in Hindu traditions is not just another of the many Hindu gods, he is a vital principle. Agni is often depicted visually with two or three faces, representing his dualistic nature, and with flaming eyes and hair, reasserting his connection with fire. He has seven fiery tongues and rides a powerful ram. He represents vital energy and sunshine. An elemental force, Agni is crucial in maintaining the balance of the universes. He is the guardian of the household and the community, symbolizing light, warmth, and hospitality, but also power and purification. He acts as a go-between in countless rituals, bringing human offerings to the gods, strengthening the connection between the earthly and the divine. One of the most well-known stories involving Agni is from the epic Mahabharata. In this story, not only was he weakened, but his hunger for fire was unquenchable, and so he asked the hero Arjuna and Krishna to help him in the endeavor to consume the Kandava forest. Although destructive, this fire is essential to regeneration and ecological balance, stressing Agni's role as an agent of purification and renewal. Indra, the god of the skies and storms, stepped in to protect the forest by sending rain to put out the fire. But Arjuna and Krishna managed to frustrate Indra's efforts by protecting Agni's fire with a blanket of arrows, allowing the forest to continue burning. Agni succeeded in devouring the entire forest, regenerating himself completely. He gratefully allowed Arjuna to keep the Gandiva bow, a powerful weapon playing a key role throughout the epic Mahabharata. Agni is ubiquitous in Hindu traditions, either in the sacred flame of a temple or in the small lamp lit in a home. This idea reinforces the belief that Agni resides everywhere there is fire, may it be in a glowing forest or within the human heart representing the inner flame of life and energy. The god holds a main place in the Vedas, the oldest and most sacred texts of Hindu literature. Agni is the essence of Vedic sacrifice and a crucial bond between mortals and the divine. The Vedic hymns describe Agni as the messenger of the gods, the immortal amongst mortals, and the purifier. These mantras, intently recited, are meant to invoke Agni's presence, bringing his blessings and protection. Practitioners seek purification, spiritual renewal, and communion with the universe through the sacrificial fire known as Agnihotra. This Agni-centric Vedic ritual is fundamental to grasping the vital role that fire and light play in the Hindu religion. While Agni is a celestial deity, he plays a palpable and daily role in the lives of Hindus. He is not just restricted to sacred texts or temples. His presence is felt in homes and in ceremonies all over the Indian subcontinent. Many Hindu homes keep a perpetual flame to honor Agni, as this symbolizes the continuity of the family and the divine blessings in the household. Agni's presence in the Vedas, in daily rituals, and in major Hindu epics proves his relevance to the Hindu people. Agni is not only a symbol of destruction and purification by fire, but also an icon of spiritual enlightenment and wisdom. His representation in the arts, literature, and everyday Hindu life bears witness to his long-lasting influence and how the eternal flame god continues to be a torch of faith, wisdom, and transformation.